Now the steps to install IntelliJ. So let's go off to the JetBrains website since they make IntelliJ. And you can see what we want is the Community Edition. So let me download that. Save that. Now if you try IntelliJ and you use it and you want some of the plugins that they have or you want to do code coverage on your tests, you won't get the code coverage in the Community Edition of IntelliJ. You can get that for free in Eclipse or you can uh, purchase an upgrade to the, the full version from the IntelliJ site. If, Intelli if JetBrains had an affiliate scheme, I would sign up to it. Good, that's finished. Now let's run the installer. Yes, I do want to run that, thank you. Okay, I will pick the default, that's fine. Desktop shortcuts always handy. Now that that's finished, let's just run it. No settings to import. And there we go. IntelliJ has installed. Next time you see this, we'll be creating a new project.